just saw it also from, I believe it was the vice president um, who sent out the general email. And um, I saw specifically in there that they were looking for traditional health workers, which I am a certified traditional health worker. And so I was like, how can I help? The approach to the project is something that isn't happening very much elsewhere in the US. Uh, and so it's kind of exciting to be involved. Also, I've just sort of felt throughout the pandemic, like I was unable to contribute in any meaningful way. And so it's sort of nice to be able to do something that may have some sort of positive impact. It's really interesting and it's really cool. And I also think just being on the other side where I'm actually engaging with the general public and I'm kind of watching a traditional health worker engage with a person who may not know much about viruses and just kind of seeing how those two can meet in the middle. That's an awesome perspective to have as a young scientist. So I have previously worked in Benton County as a community health worker for um, five years. Um, but now with this new role now, I'm training uh, more community health workers across Oregon. My role is as a technician, and so what I do is I assist the traditional health worker. I assist in handing out the materials, uh, managing materials, managing samples, uh, logistics for how we navigate neighborhoods and um, how we choose our samples. I make test kits, I put them together, so I make sure that everything that is needed for a person to test themselves is in a little folder ready to go. I make those before we go out to the field and I actually get to drive around <laughs> in a big van, so that's kind of fun. And then after that, we at the house that we select, um, the traditional health worker does the talking and I make sure that all the consent forms that are needed are out for them, I make sure that all the paperwork is, is done right. I was going into this this pilot pilot weekend, is um, there was a lot of kind of fear amongst us about how the community was going to react. But I think now that we noticed that the community is responding really well to it, um, you know, we had volunteers offering to, um, to get tested. And so um, now I feel like we're going to be going into um, the community a little bit less stressed out about the situation. I think that this can really help give the public and also Kate Brown an idea of what we actually are dealing with. Is it a big deal? Is it getting better? Or is it really getting worse? <laughs>